Hello, um, this video is going to be about um, a review on uh, the Razor Lycosa. I don't know how f if you pronounce it like that, but um, that's pretty much what it is. So, um, it's a backlit keyboard by Razer that um, has very nice key presses. Whoopsie. Um, and um, it's got this sort of rubberized texture on the top of the mouse, uh, mouse the keys that feel very nice. Um, it's got two Windows buttons. And in this corner here, um, there's the media section that has um, some press, uh, play stop volume up, volume down, uh, forward and back and tracks and you can also use that for videos also this is the button that you press, well it's not a button, it's like a touch screen that turns off the lighting if you don't want it on and then you can still see what the keys say but I like it on there's also a third option where the W, A, S and D keys which are your movement keys in some, most games um, I'll let up and nothing else and then back to the full light lit up um, this pad hand rest is removable which is quite good if you don't want it on um, the entire body of it's this shiny plastic that's reflective which is quite cool um, but it's pretty sturdy I like I like this keyboard a lot it's the best one I've had um, also, um, if you like headphones, um, there's on the back of the keyboard. Um, I can't try to get that in shot. Ah, there we go. There's a USB and a mic and a <clears throat> um, sound output on the back of your keyboard, so you can plug stuff in. I think that's how you what way around the the two jacks go but anyway I can't really see yeah um, anyway um, the other end of the uh, cable has got two USBs one for the board and one for the USB port that can be used for anything it, um, it's not uh, a hub it's like a proper um, it's just an extension of one on the back of your computer so you need to if you want it to work properly but you don't need this one I'll show you the back in fact um, one thing is a lot of the products have got a braided cable but this one doesn't it's just a thick cable I'm assuming braided means it's got the cloth wrapped around it but I'm not so sure so I'll show you the back uh, the other end of the lead <coughs> Right, the other end of the lead has this box thing here, and then it goes into. I really need to sort this. Two of these, and these two, which means that you can have everything plugged in how you want it. Um, also, this button here, the razor button, is for cycling through different things. I mean if you press the Windows key and the razor button at the same time it changes um, one of the profiles so you can use that to cycle through profiles. Um, I think you can everything on this keyboard's macroable I think last time I read the manual but <coughs> yeah it's pretty good. Um, that's what the box looks like. It's well packaged there's a, if it was in there you'd see part of the keyboard in that window um, the back is pretty cool as well I mean the package does stuff well there's all the features that it displays on the box if it would just bloody focus um, with the products you get a package that comes in the box that has all the paper manuals in it so there's a certificate of authenticity 
uh, which is quite cool. It just says that your um, stickers, which I've used, um, a product catalogue, a quick style guide, which shows you basically how to install drivers and plug it in, really. But, yeah, just wrap that up quickly. And the master guide, which has basically everything in it. So, and the actual driver disc. Um, here's the software that comes on the driver disc. It's like a, it shows you, you can change what lighting mode it's in from here um, you can change the software that the media pad controls win app uh, um, which is quite cool who uses real player I've not heard of that for years and then here's all the profiles um, at the bottom so you can set 10 for your own choice and I'm not so sure about macros uh, how to do them but you can do that they're basically uh, button pushes that do something uh, basically several button pushes that do one thing if you didn't know that so like um, a combo on the old Nintendo games. So anyway, um thanks for watching, practice and enjoy.